Good morning, family. I want to thank God. I want to thank King Jesus. I want to thank the Holy Spirit and the angels for another day, another opportunity to be here with you to spread love, peace, joy, truth, and hope to all who are watching. Praise God. Take advantage of this day that the Lord has blessed us with and uh, uh, keep your sights on Jesus. Uh, you, can, you can do marvelous things. I say Peter walked on water and uh, there, there's no telling uh, well, what we can do, you know, as long as uh, we uh, keep our sights on Jesus. Praise God. And, you know, what the best thing is salvation, everlasting life. So, you know, don't pass up that 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 trip there when Jesus comes back in the clouds. Praise God. All right. Today, uh, I'm starting to re my reading is in uh, is still in Romans. And this is uh, uh, step six. Uh, and this is uh, Romans six. Uh, this is the reading on five through eleven. We are entirely ready to have God remove all these defects of character. You know, that's a, that's a big step, you know, to uh, allow God to uh, to help you uh, grow uh, in, in spiritual maturity. And uh, that's what the 12 steps does. You know, it helps you uh, grow spiritually and, and to obtain uh, all that God created you to be because of the ego and the world will hold you back from being all that you can be in, in God, in Christ, in Jesus. And uh, Jesus led the way, and and he, and, uh, and he died. He died to clear the path. So, you know, uh, we don't uh, have those obstructions, you know, because Satan, you know, he died to, to, to wipe Satan out the way. So, you know, we, we don't have to uh, 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 fight those obstructions because Jesus already fought them for us. So, you know, that's why, you know, it's so important to keep our eyes on Jesus, because when we got our eyes on Jesus, Satan can't do nothing. Uh, all, all he can do is, you know, is is, is, is clown. And uh, and all we have to do is just, just turn away to keep our eyes off of him, look at Jesus. And uh, he, can, he can clown all he wants. And uh, it won't affect us because, you know, when when we uh, accept Jesus and we plead the blood of Jesus, Satan can't do nothing but a clown. And, and he going down. Praise God. But anyway, most of us have made numerous attempts at self-improvement president accounted for perhaps we have consciously tried to improve our attitudes our education our appearance our habits like i say you know those are all things i've worked on and uh without god's help with god's help you know i've been successful at some of them but you know uh when i try to do it by myself i always fail but uh that's why you know it's important to keep our sights on jesus because uh because uh, when we keep our sights on Jesus, we're open to, to all kind of heavenly uh, help. And, 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 and God will never let you down. Praise God. We may have had success in self-improvement on some level. However, when it comes to our struggle with defects of character, chances are we have experienced only deep frustration. You know, one thing that, that helps tremendously with, with uh, defects of character incorporating spiritual principles in your life and the three main you know spiritual principles that i've incorporated that that i've you know been uh, over 30 something years honesty open-mindedness and willingness those are three that holds up uh, the legs of my spiritual growth so you know and you know it, it's a process and you know and that process is never ending uh because uh, and, and they are great tools to fight against satan you know, honesty, open mindedness, and willingness, because those are three; those are things that uh, Satan uses to keep people down up, up, and up under his feet. So you know, but when you incorporate those three in your life, uh, you open the door for uh, for heavenly help. You get that heavenly help. Praise God. There is a reason for our frustration. These character defects can only be removed, never merely improved. The illustration. Uh, given in the Bible is that our sins and defects of character must be put to death. You got to put them to death, y'all, as Jesus was, with the hope of a new life to follow. Hey, I'm on that road, y'all. I'm, I'm on that Jesus road. I'm, I'm, uh, Jesus said, things I do, you can do it more. And uh, hey, I, I'm trudging that road. I'm happy destiny. And, and, and smiling all the way. Well, sometimes, you know, I might, might frown a little bit, but uh, but Jesus helped me put that smile back on my face. Praise God. The Apostle Paul wrote, Our old sinful selves were crucified with Christ 
so that sin might lose its power over our lives. Sin can lose its power over our lives, y'all. Hey, if you want to, uh, if you want that peace, uh, you, you let that sin, you let those sins go if you're willing, you know, and and go through that process. Uh, man, that peace, the devil can't do nothing with you when you got peace, and and, and when you're free from sin, you 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 can't be controlled. They they try to control me. They can't control me. They couldn't control Jesus. They can't control no child of God. Hey, we 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 free spirits. But uh, you're not free when you're rolling with with Satan. He got you all bind and 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 loosed and 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 got you fearful and, and got you scared of dying. And but when you roll with Jesus and, and the Holy Spirit and God, you you know you know you know you're not even afraid of death. Praise God. We are no longer slaves to sin. Those who belong to Christ Jesus have nailed the nail the passion and desires for their sinful nature to the cross and crucified them there. Hey God, going through that process, y'all. Hey, it, it can be hard, but but the uh, the work that, that we do spiritually, man, the payoff is astronomical. Salvation, everlasting life, peace, power, foresight. Man, you get those gifts of God when you do that. But you don't get those gifts from Satan. You 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 uh you're you're stunting your growth. Don't stunt your growth. Praise God. There is no band-aid cure for our sin and defects of character. These defects are fatal wounds and must be put to death on the cross. The process is never easy. It's not easy, y'all, but it's worth it. Uh, who goes to a crucif crucifixion without some measure of anxiety? Yeah, you're going to have anxiety, but that's that good pain, though. You know, because you got something great on the other side. But when we accept this and allow God to remove our defects, we will be pleasantly surprised by the new life that awaits us. Hey, hey, looking forward to it. Praise God. Uh, this is uh, Philippians 3, uh, 12. I don't mean to say that I have already achieved these things or that I have already reached perfection. But I press on to possess that perfection for which Christ Jesus first possessed me. No, dear brothers and sisters, I have not achieved it. But I focus on this one thing, forgetting the past and looking forward to what lies ahead. Hey, y'all, that's me. Uh, if y'all do that, you know, and with, with Jesus, uh, you got a lot to look forward to. because uh, uh, and, and God's got your back. Praise God. I press on to reach the end of the race and receive the heavenly prize for which God, through Christ Jesus, is calling for us. Let all who are spiritually mature agree on these things. If you disagree on some point, I believe God will make it plain to you, but we must hold on to the progress we have already made. Hey, so hold on to the progress that you made. And, you know, don't, you know, we're not going to be perfect, but but don't let that progress that you've made so far, you know, slip away because the devil going to try to take it from you. Don't let him take it from you. You know, call on Jesus. Plead the blood of Jesus and uh, and, and, it, and you're covered. So be covered by Jesus. Anyway, that's all I have today, family. I just want to say there's no relationship greater than a one with thy glorious greater. Let love reign in your life. I love you. God bless you. Thank you for watching. Have a marvelous day. Bye. Thank you.